Lucille LaCourt, Poor Sport, written by Christiane Jones, illustrated by Marissa Moray. To Bob and Mike, thanks for always being such good sports, Christiane. Lucille LaCourt loved Fridays. Why, you ask? because the Get Gaming Club met on Fridays and Lucia was the founder and president. But this Friday, something was strange. There was a sign outside the GGC's meeting spot. Try your best, have lots of fun, smile and shake when the game is done. Well, this is interesting. I did not approve this sign. You see, Lucia was good at a lot of things. She really was. Unfortunately, being a good sport was not one of those things. <laughs> Obviously, Lucia was a poor sport when she lost, but she was an even worse sport when she won. Ah, yay winner, I'm number one. A poor sport like Lucia had no time for the sign's rhyme. She ripped the sign out of the ground and stomped into the room. Who is responsible for this? The room fell silent. The truth was, all of the other members had made the sign. Lucia had been spoiling their fun, but they were too scared to tell her. If you have a problem with my club, then you can just leave, Lucia announced. If not, let's play some games. So they played some games. But nobody had fun, not even Lucia. The next Friday, Lucia brought a new game to GGC, but nobody was there. Where were her friends? I guess I'll just go home and play this game with Grandpa, Lucia said to nobody but herself. Grandpa was more than happy to play games with Lucia. However, things did not go as expected. Grandpa won the first game. He boasted as he danced around. Woohoo! In your face! Grandpa won the second game, too. He chanted as he marched around the room. I'm number one! I'm number one! That's not very nice, Grandpa! Lucia moaned. Lucia won the third game, but Grandpa was still a poor sport. You cheated! It's not fair! No, I didn't. I won fair and square, Lucia exclaimed. You are not being a good sport, Grandpa. So what should I do? He asked. With that, Lucia had a sudden realization. You should try your best and have lots of fun, then smile and shake when the game is done. That will be hard, but I'll give it a try, Grandpa replied, trying not to smile. Now off to bed. Your dad is upstairs waiting for you. As Lucia got ready for bed, she told her dad about Grandpa, about playing games with Grandpa. Grandpa was so rude, she reported. He has a tendency to be a poor sport, her dad explained. It wasn't any fun, but don't worry. I told him how he should act. And what exactly did you tell him? Her dad asked. I told him to try his best and have lots of fun, then smile and shake when the game is done, she answered. It's pretty simple. That's my girl, her dad said with a big hug. The next day, Lucia called an emergency GGC meeting. I have an announcement. I've been a poor sport and I'm sorry. Once again, the room fell silent. But then a slow clap started, followed by cheers. Her friends forgave her and couldn't wait to play games again. Try your best, have lots of fun, smile and shake when the game is done. From now on, we will start every meeting with our new pledge, Lucia explained. Lucia announced. Let the games begin. That was Lucille LaCourt, 
Poor Sport by Christiane Jones and Marissa Moray. And this is EDU Kids Space. Subscribe for more stories, books, and lessons. And if there's something in particular you'd like to learn about, leave us a message in the comments.